Hello again everyone, Edwin Leonard back once again. In this YouTube astrological segment, I'm going to be talking about the zodiac sign Libra and their health, and yes it does apply and pertain to the sun, moon, and ascendant. Well anyway people, the first thing I'll look at as far as Libra goes with their health, well, vitality may be good, adequate, not as much as the fire signs aries leo or sagittarius those are the ones that generally are going to have the most uh, stamina and energy but it believers uh, stamina energy is often just generally good but though it may not be great or stupendous now the constitution could be fair could be good as far as libra goes as well libra likes to have things balanced and probably a balanced diet is something that a lot of Libras do look at uh, as well. I do I do believe that. Um, and Libras can uh, disperse their energy very evenly. So I think Libra can be a sign I think that can pace themselves well because they like to have their balance and things and not expend too much energy on certain things or too little. So it's not a sign you would generally equate with, say, overexertion or overexpending uh, their energy because this is a sign that uh, I generally would not uh, do that. Now, the thing about Libra and their health, too, is what I think is interesting, uh, that you look at this sign, and Libra is so strongly connected with peace and tranquility. They don't like hostile or combative situations. Many people don't, but they have an even stronger aversion to it than most of the other signs, perhaps with the exception of Taurus. Now, I think when I see this sign that, okay, okay, anxiety may not be a thing associated with Libra as far as a, a strong health issue, but I think all signs can have a certain propensity toward anxiety, but for different reasons. And you look at, um, though I understand there might be some that are more susceptible to it than others, but with Libra, I think uh, what, what could happen with them as far as becoming, uh, uh, getting anxiety could be uh, a stressful living situation, a contentious or combative situation at home due to the fact that Libra is so strongly against these things generally things that are that can be volatile or disputatious if there's some kind of tension and whether it's at work or home or what have you they could succumb to anxiety they're in an environment or neighborhood that is far from peaceful or it's got a high crime rate something like that i think could make libra become very anxious and could lead to some kind of strong anxiety issue so the thing about Libra, it's very important that they find peace and, and harmony in whatever it is they do in life to try to avoid that. Now, as far as the, the physical correspondences with Libra, anatomical correspondences, which could be health issues, well, you look at the kidneys, obviously that, that is one of the issues. Libras could be very susceptible toward uh, kidney disease, kidney uh, stones, uh, some kidney failure. Uh, and just uh, really, it's a sign that they have to be very careful in, in, as far as that goes and, and really be uh, take a lot of water, probably I would say more so than the other signs because that will keep the kidneys running efficiently. Cranberries is another thing. Cauliflower, I believe, is something else that could be very beneficial to, um, to the kidneys as far as them operating uh, efficiently. And another thing, too, where Libras can have a strong propensity for health issues could be the lower back as well. Excuse me, that the lower uh, they could be susceptible to uh, a protruding or bulging disc in the lower back, the degenerative disc in, in that area of the back, in that lower part uh, of the back. Uh, and just general lower uh, back pain could be issues for for, uh, for Libra as well, and doing and doing things that might be able to uh, perhaps uh, keep it. Uh, if there's exercises, for example, uh, that might be beneficial to it, then that's what Libra uh, should do in order to reduce that chance of having problems with the lower back and also lifting things properly. If the Libra is 
at a work environment where they're doing a lot of laborious lifting and working in a warehouse or doing some kind of heavy construction where it might be some heavy lifting involved in anything strenuous lifting it's very important to use the right technique when doing so in order to uh, do the best they can to diminish those chances of having a serious injury in that area and also i mean another possibility are fractures in the back and another thing too that they could get is also lumbago and uh, what i was going to say before is in terms of things that might help Libra in in terms of the lower back situation trying to uh diminish those chances of having strong problems associated with it stretching the hamstrings could be another thing keep in mind that Pisces often falls on the sixth house cusp uh, for Libra. So Libra might be susceptible to Pisces like illnesses such as problems with the feet, such as club foot or swelling of the feet, just generally uh, foot problems, injuries, uh, could just be general foot pain. And also drugs and alcohol is it could be an issue too even though libra itself is not a sign that you would associate with that problem pisces is on um, the six uh, house cusp now that was interesting that major league former major league baseball player mark mcguire it has a son and ascendant in libra and he has pisces on his six house cusp and he was taking some i believe some performance enhancing substances now i don't know i mean you you figure these are technically there are like chemicals that he's putting into into the system and i just feel like well i don't know if there was anything there that could have potentially been detrimental to him but you could see how Libra in the, that example can can really somehow be connected with, with maybe a problem like that even though it's not really associated with the sign Libra Pisces often does fall on the sixth house cusp and keep in mind too that uh, Libra is a sign that they're often uh, strongly that they like to uh, often want to collaborate and do things with others they're very partnership oriented now as far as a mental health issue I was thinking that maybe uh, the mentalist monophobia which is a is fear of being alone Libras really, uh, they, they like to do things more with others than uh, most other signs, so as far as a partnership, especially situation. And uh, that, that could be, the monophobia could be one thing, and also perhaps passive aggressive behavior could be possible in some extreme cases with the zodiac sign. Libra, well, anyway, people, that'll conclude this YouTube astrological segment for the zodiac sign Libra and their health and stay tuned next time where I'll be talking about the zodiac sign Scorpio and their health two things I want to get with you on before I head out firstly the stars may impel but do not compel and secondly never isolate any single astrological element aspect planetary placement position configuration influence or what have you and make an analysis of a person astrologically speaking based on this alone because astrologically speaking the person is the sum of all their components in their natal chart and not just one until next time people stay well